Hello friends, welcome. Here I will explain about sunflower, the flower biology, heterosis and other package of practices and related issues of sunflower I will be covering. Sunflower is scientifically called as Helianthus anus, belong to Asteraceae family or Composite, having chromosome number 2n equal to 34. In Canada, it is called as Surya Kanti, Surya Pan. In Hindi, Suraj Mukhi. Largest family of flowering plants belonging to Composite family. According to James Reveal, family contains 1550 genera and 24,000 species. Sunflower is a day neutral, can be grown in any season. Important all seed crop in the world, it contains oil of 46 to 52 percent. Helianthus derived from Greek word Helios means sun and Anthos means flower. It's a fourth most important crop after soybean, groundnut, rapeseed in the world. Genus name associated with heliotropism that is towards attraction towards sunshine. Flowers move to track the sun. Systematics, kingdom, plantae, division, phenerogams, class, dicotyledonae, subclass, gamipetalae, order, asterales, family, asteraceae, subfamily, helianthidae, tribe, helianthae, and genus, helianthus. Binomial name is, as we know, helianthus annus. Sunflower genome. The sunflower helianthus annus genome is deployed with a basic chromosome number of 17 and an estimated genome size of 2871 to 3189 megabase pairs that is 2.8 to 3.2 GB. Some sources claim it is true size is around 3.5 billion base pairs slightly larger than human genome. Other species of sunflower, many species of genus Helianthus and many species in other genera that may be called sunflowers. The Maximilian sunflower that is Helianthus maximilini that is uh, perennial sunflower native to North America. The sun choke commonly called Helianthus tuberosus also called as perennial sunflower it is perennial in nature. The Mexican sunflower is Tithonia rotundifolia. It is very distinctly related to North American sunflowers. Wild species of sunflower. Around seven uh, wild species are enlisted here. First one is Helianthus anomalous. All are having chromosome number of 34. Then Helianthus argophilus, Helianthus Balanderi, Helianthus debilis, species debilis, then Helianthus deserticola, Helianthus paradoxus, and Helianthus pitiolaris. The other wild species are Helianthus nivensis, species canescens, Helianthus preox, species hirtus, Helianthus preocox, species precox, Helianthus Precox species Ranioni, Helianthus nutelli, and Helianthus tuberosus. Origin It originated in central parts of USA. This hypothesis is based on archaeological evidence. Sunflower is the state flower of US state of Kansas, the national flower of Ukraine. In India, this crop was introduced in 1969 from Russia or USSR. Importance It's an ornamental crop and later food and medicinal purpose. Ground for its oil used for culinary purpose, preparation of vanaspati and manufacture of margarines, soaps and cosmetics.
it consists of high oleic and linoleic acid content in the oil hence recommended for people with cardiovascular disease in summer green plants used for fodder and silage the whole seed that is non oil grade it can also be bird fed oil cake is also prepared and cattle and poultry feed the parched seeds can also be consumed as condiment let us come to domestication of sunflower sunflower is native to central america the evidence is that it was first domesticated in meso meso america maybe mexico by at least 2600 bc it may have been domesticated a second time in the middle mississippi valley or been introduced there from mexico the earliest known examples of a fully domesticated sunflower north of mexico have been found in tennis around 2300 bc major sunflower growing countries in the world are ussr usa india africa france argentina composition of the seed this is biochemical aspect the hull composition is around 21 to 27 percent kernel oil is 48 to 53 percent protein is 14 to 19 percent soluble sugars around 8 to 10 percent crude fiber 16 to 27 percent and ash content of 2.4 to 3 plant morphology of sunflower it's an annual erect plant and some are biennial or perennial also the plant height in annuals is 50 to 500 cm stem diameter of 1 to 10 cm depending on number length of internodes sparse hair all along the stem central strong tap root system leaves are opposite alternate pair inflorescence is called capitulum or head is not a single flower it's made up of around 1000 to 2000 individual flowers joined at a common receptacle the flowers around the circumference are ligulate ray flowers without stamens or pistils the remaining flower are perfect flower or disc flower with stamens and pistils here it is a flower dia flor floral uh, morphology ray floret this is uh, the diagram of ray floret uncoiled from the central first then here the ray floret is folded and bracts that is involucral blast uh, bract called as filaries are around surrounding the ray floret that is called as the head is called as capitulum two basic kinds of flowers in the asteraceae are disc flower and ray flower disc flower is actinomorphic and ray flower is zygomorphic this is very important disc flower is most commonly consisting of the hermaphrodite florets but ray flower sometimes it is sterile also the calyx is represented by peppers stamens are epipetalous but the filaments above the corolla tube while the anthers are connate into a tube with pollen shed inside the tube the ovary is syncarpous with two carpels inferior this is a flower structure floral structure is given in vertical section here this is corolla tube and uh, this is developing seed here inside the flower petals are given that is outside and uh, petals are covered with bracts and the final bract which is covering the other bracts is involucral bract and the central part which is a pad shaped is receptacle and these are the small one ovary this is a disc flower that is corolla of disc flower and corolla of ray flower this is corolla of ray flower and outside the 
small small bract like appearance are fillaries and the inside structure is receptacle this is again the ray floret uh, in gynoecium this is uh, uh, stigmas there are two stigma and uh, this is style and finally the ovary and here the bract ovary style are shown here head the showing an outer ring of large sh strap shaped ray flower surrounding a dense mass of small tubular disc flowers the ovaries of the disc flowers ripen into the stipped achenes sold in markets as sunflower seeds the entire head is subtended by green overlapping bracts called filaries this is floral formula and for a floral diagram uh, as uh, the composite family floral diagram is, uh, and formula are given here it is a hermaphrodite plant flower biology sunflower is highly cross pollinated crop mainly through insects and to a limited extent by wind flower opening starts from outer side of the head and proceeds towards the center head blooms within 5 to 10 days depending upon size and season proto protandus nature of sunflower is accompanied by a time log of 10 to 12 hours in the maturation of male and female element and this is occur between 5 to 8 am pollen grains be viable last for 12 hours stigma remains receptive for 2 to 3 days the progressive stages of anthesis first it will be like this very small um, ray and disc florets then it will start differentiating again differentiation clear cut differentiation and finally the maturity means the clear pollination stage where it will yield turmeric powder like fine pollen as well as inside the floret the ovary will mature into seeds the outer whorl of disc flower opens first proceeding gradually towards the center of the head generally 2 or 2 to 4 whorls open daily and complete flowering occurs within a head in 5 to 8 days view of mature head this is a mature head where black color grains appear it's a close up view it is called as achenes embedded in the receptacles each achene this is an achene each achene is subtended by a small green chaffy bract chaffy bract is here coming to the breeding methods different breeding methods in sunflower are mass selection pustovet method of reserve heterosis breeding development of inbreds development of cms line and finally development of fertility restorer line pustovet method was popularly introduced from ussr and modifications were introduced in india where the mass selection it was combination of mass selection and bulk breeding method where large number of very productive lines were selected and allowed for open pollination then again selection for the uniform that is positive mass selection yielded lot of uh, lines which were afterwards used for developing the male sterility system and hybrid seed production and uh, this made a revolution in development or improvement of the indian sunflower oil industry the most important contributions to the development of sunflower were made by pustovet and jordno in the soviet union who increased the oil concentration in sunflower seed above 500 grams per kg leclerc of france discovered first usable source of cms that is cytoplasmic male sterility in a cross of 
helianthus petiolaris into helianthus annus. Kinman of United States developer fertility restorer line RHA 265 and RHA 266 which allowed practical development of sunflower hybrids. Selfing it's, it, it is done by bagging of the head bagging with the cotton cloth bag or paper bag or cheese cloth bags or plastic bags. Immediately after emasculation the flower or inflorescence enclosed with suitable bags of appropriate size to prevent random cross cross pollination. This is a process of selfing here bagging of the head. Hand emasculation these are different techniques of emasculation first is hand emasculation that is removing of amber tubes with forceps early in the morning that the flower opens unemasculated flowers are removed without emasculation sometimes crosses are made without emasculation hybrid plants are distinguished from self ones on basis of vigor or on the presence of marker genes chemical induction of male sterility for this spray 0.005 percent solution of ga3 or plant during blood bud, uh, bud initiation pollination naturally cross pollinated as i already told supplementary pollination by hand pollination or by keeping beehives in hand pollination rubbing the heads with palm covering with muslin cloth having pollen from the male line hybrid seed production generally cgms that is cytoplasmic genetic male sterility system is followed in hybrid seed production of sunflower a scheme of our commercial hybrid seed production in sunflower is first one a line into b line a line is male sterile b is menterial line of a line that will give a line and if we'll cross it with the r line again we'll get the hybrid one this is nothing but the three line system or cgms system of hybrid seed production commonly used in sunflower These are some of the techniques while going for uh, emasculation, pollination and all those things. Here uh, this is a photograph representing collection of pollens from B line, B is maintainer line, then dusting B pollen on A line that is maintenance of A line means finally uh, this uh, cross between B line here B line is male line and A line is uh, mm, a female line by crossing these two again we will get the A line that is nothing but maintenance of the sterility and if we we'll cross with the R line finally we will get the hybrid seed pollen collection and pollination this is uh, how the farmers or uh, the people involved in crossing technique they collect the pollens from uh, opened completely opened sunflower heads finally we will get the hybrid line breeding goals of sunflower in sunflower high seed yield early maturity lodging resistant dwarf plant type single head type uniformity of plant type high oil percentage tolerance to stress resistant to bird damage resistant to disease and insect pests importance uh, sunflower improvement in present day sunflower three phases of improvement during 1900 to 1940 transformation of branching to monostem potential source of oil by pustovet during 1940 to 1960 floral biology disease resistance self incompatibility heterosis all these things were improved in 1969 as i already told you this was introduced to india and uh, at the same period stable cms source identified by leclerc france in helianthus petiolaris into helianthus annus popularly called as pet one 
in 1970, Kinman identified fertility restoring source in USA. In India, in 1972, AICRP on oil seeds started at Kota, Bangalore, Akola, Digraj, and Coimbatore. In 1977, varietal renovation programs started. In 1980, modern BSH-1 uh, uh, varieties released, varieties and hybrids. Development of Surya, SS-56, Co-1 and uh, other varieties were also released subsequently. Major diseases of sunflower, first one is downy mildew that is Plasmapora halstidi, powdery mildew, Ericifae Cicoratiarum, leaf spot, Septoria helianthi, verticillium wilt, Sclerotini sclerotiorum, rust, Paxinia helianthi, then uh, Sclerotinia head and stem rot, that is verticillium deliae, Foma black stem, that is Foma mcdonaldi. Downy mildew, Plasmapora halstidi, uh, this is uh, a picture or uh, this is a photograph representing the downy mildew at the back side of the uh, leaf or uh, F floral primordia which cause around 90% of the yield loss and this is rust caused by Paxinia helianthi. Here we can see the rust spores. Leaf spot that is Alternaria helianthi due to leaf spot by collision and joining of the uh, spots together finally it will uh, make a havoc in the fields of sunflower. This is head rot where the head portion is completely damaged caused by rhizopus species. Sclerotium wilt, this is a wilt plot and charcoal rot, this is a picture representing charcoal rot. This is management this can be controlled by spraying mancozeb at the rate of 400 grams per acre two to three times at 10 days interval from 20 days after sowing. Major pests Foliage feeding pests First one is jazz seed called as Ambraska bigutula bigutula Then white fly is Bemisia tabasi They suck the, these are the sucking pests They suck plant sap and make the plants weak and withheld. To control this endosulfan 400 ml at the rate of 1 ml per liter of water or pentheon 200 ml gives effective control for these sucking insects. The another important one is capitulum borer which uh, causes severe yield or oil yield loss. This pest causes damage to the head by feeding the developing seeds. The adult are nocturnal in habit, means uh, very active during night hours. Control measures are collection and destroying of caterpillars, keeping pheromone traps, dusting 5% endosulfan dust or fasolon 4% dust at the rate of 10 kg per hectare. Grasshopper damage, that is Crotogonus species. Another one is head clipping weevil. Bird damage during seed development in sunflower. They may be considered damage caused by birds, especially parrots. To control the seed damage, any of the methods can be adapted. Manual scaring by making noise with tin box. Automatic gun may be used uh, for producing noise at constant intervals. Since parrots cause considerably loss to quality seeds, at most care must be taken, especially during maturity period. Coming to the heterosis breeding. Heterosis is well explained in sunflower and uh, discovery of male sterile lines made hybridization program very easy. Steps is development of inverts, development of CMS lines, 
may a, it that is a b and r line and hybridization first step is development of inbreds the most common method of developing inbred in sunflower are pedigree selection bulk single seed descent method and back crossing the process of inbreeding and selection may continue for 2 to 5 generation till the lines get homozygous and homogeneous most of the inbreds in sunflower are derived from open pollinated varieties coming to the second step development of abr lines hybrids developed using cms or a line maintainer or b line and restorer r line cms lines are developed by repeated back crossing using non cms lines as female parent about 5 to 6 back crosses are required to derive a new cms line genetically similar to the recurrent parent the inbred which was used as a recurrent parent or male parent serve as maintainer or b line crossing of inbred line to restorer line and test crossing with cms line to ascertain which plants possess fertility restorer gene in subsequent generations to get r lines hybrid seed production technology it's a third step though it is highly cross pollinated crop honeybees act natural cross pollination by wind is negligible seed production of hybrid seed sunflower involving a and b line and r line require artificial hand pollination for good seed set this is a schematic representation as i already explained in the previous slide and this is uh, just an example how the kbsh1 was developed by using cms 234a into cms 234b to maintain the a line again the a line that is cms 234a into rha uh, 6d-1 that is r line which gave the f1 hybrid that is kbsh1 for sunflower hybrid seed production three important techniques are followed that is self incompatibility gms and cms and cgms self incompatibility it was first reported by habura in 1957 and later confirmed by lucinao in 1965 two dominant alleles are responsible for the presence of sporophytic incompatibility system in cultivated sunflower the protrandus nature of sunflower accompanied by self incompatibility has been utilized in sunflower for developing hybrids in canada the hybrid seed production utilizing incompatibility requires planting the male and female lines in alternate rows and harvesting the hybrid seeds from female parent gms this was first identified by kuptso in 1934 this was used to produce hybrid seeds in early 1970s in france and in romania by putan kinman gms necessitates maintenance of male sterility genes in heterozygous condition here it is given this is recessive form of ms and uh, into heterozygous condition of ms and that will give one is to one ratio of sterile and fertile lines cms landmark in commercial sunflower hybrid was the discovery of cms by lecrec in 1969 in the progeny of a cross between helianthus spicularis and cultivated sunflower helianthus annus there are about 71 different cytoplasmic sources which have been identified and characterized in sunflower but still pet one source is being used in commercial hybrid seed production program genes for genetic restoration of fertility was found in wild species by kinman in 1970 CMS sources several new sources of uh, cytosterols being being used in breeding program first one is CMS F that is Helianthus pitiolaris 
CMS PF means Petiolaris species, Phylax, L means Lenticularis, CMS 3 is Helianthus maximilinea, CMS 1 is Helianthus gigantus and CMS petit 2 is Helianthus petiolaris. Cytoplasmic male sterility sources is Helianthus petiolaris, species petiolaris which is perennial and small flowering nature. Here this is a diagrammatic representation how the A, B and R line look. Here this is A line showing no pollen production. Here we can't find any pollens. This is B line which is having the pollens to maintain the A line and R line the head is completely or abundance of pollen grains to cross with the A line. Hybrid vigor in sunflower. Sunflower hybrids were evaluated for yield performance, standard heterosis in adene or turkey condition. The highest heterosis was found in oil yield. Development in India introduction of open pollinated high yielding russian varieties like periodivik and amari whiskey aicrp on oil seed developed experimental hybrids in 1974-75 at bengaluru using cms lines cms2 cms134 124 cms204 cms234 and two restorer lines RHA 266 and RHA 274 introduced from USA. All the hybrids were distinctly superior to the Czech variety. Uh, Parodivik, both in seed and oil yield. The first hybrid BSH1 was released for commercial cultivation during 1980. Three more hybrids were released for cultivation APSH11 from Hyderabad, LDMR SH1 and 3 from Latur Center in Maharashtra. In 1992, KBSH1 developer at Bengaluru was released for cultivation in all sunflower growing areas. Across the locations in country, KBSH1 ranked first with a sealed seed yield of 1000, 1.7 tons per hectare and oil yield of 0.7 tons per hectare. Exotic hybrids from private seed companies like uh, Advance, PAC 3425, PAC 36 are also quite popular. AICRP on uh, sunflower was in uh, the headquarters is in Bengaluru. In 1974, number of hybrids developed by CMS lines that are BSH1 and BSH2 were found promising hybrids and uh, the BSH1 parentage is CMS 234A into RHA 274, KBSH 41, the parentage is CMS 234A into RHA 95-C-1, KBSH 42 parentage is CMS 851A into RHA 95-C-1 Sunflower hybrid KBSH 41 yielded 15 to 17 quintals per hectare with oil content of 42% KBSH 42 and KBSH 42 have been recommended for Southern Central, Eastern Dry and Southern Traditional Zones These are tolerant to downy mildew alternary arrest and necrotic diseases. The performance of these varieties at all India level has outscored all other private hybrids. 
silent features of sunflower hybrids developed and uh, released by us bangalore is uh, given in this table the oil content seed yield duration uh, oil yield the maximum duration was 100 days these are some of the hybrids the hybrids released from different states are given here in karnataka the popular were kbsd series and chalamukhi in maharashtra mm, the same and some of the maharashtrian lines likewise in different states important hybrids in karnataka bsh1 with a duration of 85 to 90 seed yield of 10 to 15 quintals per hectare kbsh1 in all india kbsh11 also in all india apsh11 in andhra pradesh which was having slight longer duration that is uh, 95 to 100 days giving uh, 10 to 13 quintals per hectare lsh that is uh, latur sunflower hybrid one from maharashtra also giving less yield of 9 to 12 quintals then uh, pkvsh 27 from maharashtra that was also less yielding but very short duration of 75 to 80 days research institutes in india aicr based in sun on sunflower which is in uh, bengaluru then directorate of oil seed research in uh, rajendranagar hyderabad telangana then project in 1989 promotion of research and development efforts on hybrid sin sunflower nine centers were project in the project directorate one is in akola then bengaluru coimbatore rajendranagar bhuvaneshwar bhavani sagar ludhiana latur dharwad and project coordinating unit bengaluru private hybrid seeds from uh, uh, mahiko that is mkh11 singenta hybrids do blend cl ganga kaveri seed like gk2002 2009 then indo american hybrid seeds arun ravi aditya nature great seeds international limited suryanath 903 suryanath 904 and all those series future of sunflower breeding for increased yield and higher productivity to multi environment development of self fertile production and hybrids along with disease resistance open pollinated varieties should be encouraged for growing in mixed and as a pure crop under scanty rainfall and in marginal and sub marginal lands thank you for watching this video you uh, please subscribe to my channel varu gaitonde thank you